Hey New York Daily News.com readers, this is Andy Martino, your Mets beat writer down here at Mets Camp in Port St. Lucie. It's high 80s today, which is a lot warmer than where you are, so I'm feeling pretty good about that. And the Mets are feeling pretty good about the fact that Carlos Beltran approached Terry Collins today and asked to move to right field. This makes Angel Pagan the center fielder, and it prevents the team from having a potentially awkward situation where Beltran, the veteran who has concerns about his knees, uh, is insisting that he can still play his old position, center field. Instead, knowing that he wasn't feeling 100% and hoping that moving to right would extend his career, Beltran requested the change. So he's going to continue with his running program for a few days. Beltran's going to DH in some games over the weekend. And then about seven days after that, he's going to move to right field, which should give him, if everything goes well in the situation, about two weeks to learn the position of right field. So this is a relief for Terry Collins to avoid the awkwardness of the situation, but the team still has to be concerned about Beltran's knees. Ideally, they'd be 100% and he'd be able to play center field. So it's good that he's recognizing that that's not the case, but until he's out on the field playing well, running the bases, and showing that he's healthy, the team has to be somewhat concerned about a guy who they're really counting on to have a big year. If Beltran plays well and he's in the final year of a seven-year contract, the Mets might be able to look at trading him over the course of the summer and bringing back some kind of return, whether it's in prospects or even some major league players. If that does not work out, if Beltran is not healthy and productive, he's going to finish out his Mets career, which began with such fanfare with a whimper. So there's still a lot to wonder about with Beltran, but the major storyline of the early spring, was he going to move to right field willingly, has been cleared up. He did a team first move and a, a move that's going to frankly be good for him as well if it works out and he decided it's time to squash this early and it's time for me to move to right field. So that's the big story out of Mets camp today and we'll see you soon. This is Andy Martino.